Hello friends, my name is Theo, and today in this exciting Meester Media quick tip tutorial, we'll be taking a look at how to fix audio that is only in one of your ears. Now the first step of this is identifying it, so make sure that you have, you know, headphones or speakers that work. Don't just be monitoring your audio off your laptop speakers. That is irresponsible, shame on you. So if we listen to this, you can hear it. That's just in my left ear. And if you look over at our meters here, you can see it's just on the left side. So that is no good. So my favorite way of doing this is selecting all the clips that you want to change. In this case, I just have this one clip, but you know, if you have a bunch of interview clips that are all recorded the same way with audio only on the left channel, then you can just select all the clips, then right click, go to clip attributes. And this works in the media pool in both the timeline page that I'm in now and also in the media pool. And you can go to clip attributes, then audio. The two ways to do this is to change the format to mono, mono, and then you're all good. But the way I tend to do it, just because it's a little faster, is just change the embedded audio to channel one. So you can see now our left track is gonna be taking our channel one audio and our right track is gonna be taking our channel one audio. So this channel one is what's gonna be on your left side normally, but also maybe if you're recording on channel two, you can do the same trick there. And I just gravitate towards this because it's fewer clicks, it goes a little faster. It's a little neater to do the mono thing, but here we're just gonna do it this way. And then we hit okay. And if we play this through, you'll hear it's still wrong. But if we delete this and re-add our clip into the media pool, you can hear this is where it's at. now we are correct. So another way you can do this is let's go ahead and undo what we did there. So clip attributes, change this back to the way it was, hit okay, delete this clip. So we can add a new audio track and just make a mono one here. And now we can add our clip in before and you see we are in our previous audio track that we we're in. And if we play this, it's still wrong. You see down there, but if we move this down to our new audio track, let's go ahead and hit alt and drag so things are a little more behaved. Now if we play this through, this is, just like this that. Is it, man. So if you've already got a bunch of clips in your timeline, this is probably the easier way to do it, is just create a new audio track and you can you know, name this whatever you want. Mono. If you're doing a bunch of interviews, you know, just put all your audio for that on there and you can see which track is the mono because it's got this 1.0 there. These other ones are stereo tracks with so this 2.0. And you see, if we want to be really cool, we can add a 5.1 track and you see 5.1. So just that easy. Hopefully that helps you out. It's very embarrassing to upload a video with audio only in one channel. So make sure you check this. So hope this helped out. If you appreciate this sort of stuff, like, subscribe, comment, et cetera. And be sure to check out meastermedia.com slash products. We've got lots of stuff there to help you do other things faster, easier, better. And the faster you do things, the more time you have for going sailing. So once again, I've been Theo with Meastermedia. Have a great day and I will see you next time. Bye.